So as you can see, it feels kind of like I'm in the middle of Ambon, like right in the heart. You know, it just feels like any other busy city in Indonesia. You know, but Ambon, of course, is also known for its beautiful beaches, its scuba diving, its snorkeling. And well, I'll get there, I'll get there. I want to explore the, the city first and get a get a good idea of what Ambon's like in the heart of the city, you know? And gotta do my thing first before I go see some of the the uh, the most the more sought after tourist attractions, the beaches. And so this is the kind of stuff that I like to do. Explore the local markets and uh, get a feel for the city, you know. Hey Alpha Kabar. Bye. Bye. You know, and just meet the nice people out here working every day. Hey, hey! Hello. And so, yeah, eventually I'll put on my swimsuit, I'll go to the beach, and, uh, I'll find some of these pristine beaches here. And not only that, like off in that direction, off pretty much probably in any direction, you got the beautiful rainforest, the jungle, but not yet. Hello. So this is what I wanted to come check out. The World Peace Gong. And it looks like you have some, uh, some Indonesian army soldiers here checking it out as well so let's see if they'll let me in let's see if they'll let me in hello hello apa kabar baik berapa lima ribu so it just cost five thousand to come here very reasonable very cheap that's fifty thousand Uh, one Ooh. Maybe they have uh, some English Bahasa English. Oh, in Indonesia, in Bahasa. Uh -huh. Any English? <coughs> Bless you. Bless you. <laughs> but here, all about Bahasa. Ah, uh, it's on Bahasa. That's okay. That's it's okay. okay. Thank you, though. And so, yeah, I was reading. There are 35 of these uh, all around the world. Or when this one was built in 2009, it was the 35th one. There might be more now. Hello. Samoa Army? Navy? Yes. Army? Or Navy? Army? Army, okay. No. Uh, Army we Saga? Are, we are from Java. Oh, you're from Java? Yeah. Oh, okay. Swiss, Swiss. Why, why are you in Ambon? No. Uh, uh, we want to Satgas. You want operation. to work? Uh, operation? Yes. Ah, uh, okay. Chocolate, chocolate. One, two, three. Okay, check it out. On this side over here, they've got a lot of a stalls set up, but looks like they're all closed. What's up? This? Yeah, it says. Okay. Okay. All 
So you gotta love that. It's all about world peace, guys. It's all, all about coming together. We're all brothers and sisters on this planet. <laughs> but yeah, this, uh, this monument was built to, I don't know, clean up, but just kind of, you know, change Ambon's image because in World War II, there was a, a nasty, atrocious, I mean, just absolutely brutal massacre that happened right when the Japanese took over the island. It happened over on the other side by uh, Laha, where the airport is. But this is something that didn't come out until after the war. It was kept a secret the entire time. But 300 Australian soldiers were brutally decapitated and executed by the Japanese over a two week, over a two week period whenever the Japanese took over the island. I'm hoping I can go see a monument uh, for the for the slain soldiers if I can find one. We're gonna make our way over to the other side of the island eventually. And so that happened here in Ambon. And then we're coming up here on what is called Fort Victoria, a fort that was built by the Portuguese in 1588, I believe. The Portuguese were the first European presence here in Ambon. In like 1505 or 1510, they came here. And for a good century, up until 1605, you know, I wouldn't say they had control of Ambon, but they, uh, they were the only European presence here. Successful European presence. But it was the Dutch that ultimately won out in the end. And this fort right here, I'm not sure if we can get in. I think it's a military base now. I'm not sure if we can get in this place. You can see all the way through there, that's the, uh, the fort. Keep going? Okay. All right, I got uh, told to keep on going. I'm just trying to share some history here. All righty, so I was just walking around this park right here and uh, Nike, right? Yeah, my name is Nike. Nike. He called me, I was like, hey, you doing YouTube? I was like, yeah, yeah. He's like, I've watched some of your videos. And it turns out Nike is going to military school, military nice. training yeah. right over here, right? Not, not really right there. Not but here, but... I'm just doing the selection from for the military academy. Okay, so yeah. you're at the beginning stages? Yeah, the beginning stages. Gotcha, gotcha. And so he was just telling me a little bit about this area. Um, I was telling him I wanted to get in there to see yeah, but Fort Victoria, but it's closed because of the... It's an army base now. Yeah, army base. But when I was walking over there just now, there's a statue right in front of it. That's, that was a soldier from the Independence War. Yeah. In 1949. I guess, maybe. Whenever the Dutch you know, came back. Yeah. and I'm guessing they, they took control of the island. The, the Dutch, island, yeah. The you know, they, they came back and were able to take and back the control. Indonesia invaded. And then Indonesia actually invaded their, whole, their own island. Yeah. And, just say, free, free it. You know? Right. Just to, to free it. Yeah. And that statue commemorates the guy that was shot by the Dutch. Yeah. Colonel Slamatriagi. Okay. This guy is Patimura. Patimura. Yeah. And he's in he is, his real name is Thomas Matulesi. He was a uh, his name is Thomas. Thomas. Yeah. Really? Yeah. But he he was given the title of Patimura. Patimura. What does that mean? Well, I don't know the real meaning, but Patimura. The people here say that Patimura means uh, the king. Mm -hmm. Like king goes to the people and you know serves. I don't know. Yeah, like the king who serves his people. Okay. I guess. Yeah. Okay. So he is a warrior, uh -huh. and he's also a former British soldier. Okay, so he when is British. British. Uh, is he British? No, he's Moluccan. Oh, he's uh, from Maluku. Okay, but he fought for the British. Not there. Hey, yes, hey. Yes, 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 yes. But he was he was a British soldier uh -huh. when British took control of the island. 
Oh, okay. Yeah. Not World War II. No. Uh, I'm way off. <laughs> about 1800, I guess, or 1700. Oh, when, this is, you this know, is the, the, the Napoleon Wars. The, the uh, Napoleonic War, I think. Yeah, Napoleon, yeah. Uh, and then after the Napoleonic War, the British said, all right, you can have it back. Yeah. Basically, can back. you can have it Basically, back. Basically, yeah. At that point, I think they had already taken all the nutmeg trees and uh, planted them in their British colonies yeah. everywhere else. And so they were like, yeah, we don't really need the Spice Islands anymore. We've kind of taken the spices to our British colonies. And so they just <laughs> kind of gave it back to the Dutch. So he fought for his people, uh, okay. Patimura. And he was actually execu executed in front of this fort also. He was executed here? Yeah, he was hanged. Wow. That's what I was kind of getting at. Uh, I didn't even tell this story. The, the Amboya Massacre of 1623. That's what yeah. I was... I was standing over there talking and, uh, and one of the officers was like waving me. <laughs> He's like, you, I'm like, all right, my bad, my bad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, in 1623, there was the massacre of 21 people, uh, mostly the English, some Japanese samurais, the Ronin, but yeah. they were executed at Fort Victoria. In front of, yeah. Before Victoria. Right. So, uh, anyways, I'm trying to tell a little bit of the history of Ambon, and it kind of has a little bit of a dark history. Yeah. Dark, yeah. You know, a lot of, a lot of war. And Wars, yeah. A lot of it. A lot of war. Really. A lot of bloodshed, a lot of war, a lot and of life. Is there anything good to see around here, you think? I think only the. Just the square here? Yeah. What is this huge building right here? That one. Yeah. This is the governor's office. This is the governor's office. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Wow. Some kind of you know. Do they do any like military training or anything out no, here? No, no, no. It looks like it'd be used for. It used for you know, sometimes the people want to run you know. Okay, just a public park. Public park. Public yeah. space. No, public spaces. So Ambon is a city of music. Yes. Yeah. Like, Let's talk a little. Talk about a little bit of something better than massacres and killings yeah. and like a lot of people here them. yeah they can sing really yeah so is there like a lot of live music here a lot, yeah, of, live a lot, of, a lot of places okay live music a lot of cafes and uh is there what is the the musical instrument of choice in ambon the musical instrument i mean is, I, do they have any like a i don't know an old traditional, traditional instruments here or is it actually i'm from I'm not from Maluku, so uh, okay. I don't really know. Gotcha. Whew. It is warm out here. Yeah. yeah. Not like Bandung. Yeah, Bandung is a little cooler. Yeah, cooler. And I was in Malang and Batu and that area. Batu, yeah. Oh, so much better. So much cooler. Not better, just cooler. All right, man. Best okay. of luck. Wish you all the best. No, I wish yeah, you the yeah. best, man. Good luck, yeah. brother. Thank, Thank you. you. Hope you enjoy your I time will. here. I will. Appreciate it, Nike. Nike, right? Nike, yeah. Nike? Like the brand? Okay, Nike? Nike, yeah. Okay, Nike. Alright man, see ya. Yeah. So, I've met a Nike. Remember the guy in Jakarta at the, the train station? The, at the at the booth, he was like, Nick, Nike, Nick, Nike. Yeah, man. Okay. What is your name? Nick. Nike. Nick. Nike. Nike. Uh, Nick. I mean, uh, Nick. Nick. Nicky. Nick. Nick. Okay. We're going to continue on. And I want to show you the area that I went to last night where my gym was at. It looked like a pretty busy part of town. A lot of shops, some apartments on top of those shops. It was an interesting area. So uh, I'll try not to screw up on some of this history. <laughs> Just remember, don't really take anything I say as 100% uh, true. <laughs> I'm learning as we go along. I'm going to mess things up, but look at that. Woo. Oh, got sprayed up the shorts. Uh-oh. Might have felt good, actually. Okay, so all this in here is all military. All army uh, personnel is what Nike was saying. So... I want to watch the filming. Oh, 
Alrighty, let's have a look around. Let's go into this market. See what they're selling. Nice. Roti. Hello, hello, hello. Looks like they're kind of all selling the same thing. Jalan-jalan. Uh, uh, Di sana. Nak beli. Kenari. Mm, nak beli, nak beli. Ini roti kenari. Yeah, this one. Oh, oh, oh. Enak. Well. Alright, since I broke it. <laughs> Alright, berapa? Dua puluh. Dua puluh. Mister dari mana, negara mana? Amerika. Ya, yeah, California. No, Texas. Some uh, some bread it looks like covered in not really sure. Bread's pretty hard too. It's really hard. This tastes like dried bread. I'm not sure if that's. I don't know. Any idea what that is? No idea. Mm. Alright, so this is kind of the area I wanted to come check out again, come show you guys. This has to be kind of the heart of Ambon. And what might be some of the oldest parts of the city, maybe. Can I go that way? Hello. Hey, hey. Okay, so this is the uh, the terminal, Mardika. This must be where you would come if you wanted to take a ferry or go somewhere, go somewhere else maybe. And also, just looks like a big market. Hello. You can see all these different colored buildings, kind of remind you of the Rainbow Village in Milan. Maybe a little bit. Just like those buildings in Milan, they need a, a fresh, fresh touch up. Man, this is a sight to see right here. Hello. 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 Yes. Yes. Panas. Panas, yeah. It's hot. It's hot. It's hot. Harini panas. Harini panas. I ain't ever been anywhere like this. <laughs> That's uh, my first time to see anything like this, I think, even here in Indonesia. Hmm. Okay, so maybe this is a bus terminal. There's a lot of Angkots. This, maybe this is where you come if you want to go somewhere. Again. I don't really know. Hmm. <laughs> Hello. Yeah, it's basically just a big market. The uh, the ocean is right on the other side of these stalls right here. What an interesting place. <laughs> what an interesting place. Yeah, you can smell the fish now. Oh yeah. Woo. Ooh. Wow, those are uh, cooked and ready to go. Ikan bakar? Maybe? Ooh. 
Hello, my friend. Hey, hey. How are you? Alright. I don't really know where I'm going. I'm just kind of wandering. Hello! And uh, we're just going to see how far this market goes. Let's keep going. Hello, mister. Hey, hey. Ikan bakar? Ikan bakar. Wow. Ikan bakar. Basar. Besar. Basar. Ini berapa? Berapa ini? Lima, lima ribu? Lima puluh. Lima puluh. Lima puluh ribu? Iya, lima puluh ribu. So, that's like three dollars for a home big old fish. I don't know what I would do with it. What do we got to say? Thank you. Those are a funky color. Hello. You ever seen fish that color? Like, those fish were glowing. Is that normal? Hello. I'm fine. How are you? Good. Good. <laughs> I like your smile. I'm fine, thank you. So yeah, it's a market. Come get your vegetables, your fruits, your chilies, your tofu, your spices. I still haven't seen any cloves or nutmeg. I don't think you can find any of that down here, but... Some coconuts. And it just keeps on going, keeps on going. Hey! Apa kabar? Bike, bike. Let's go inside the building. Hello. Bisa masuk? Bisa? Bisa. 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 Wow, wow. Hello. Tuna, tuna. This tuna, yeah? Yeah, yes. Magaro. Yeah, Magaro. Magaro. So, so, big old makes some sushi. Wow, look at those guys. Good tuna. So, uh, we need like satu, berapa? Satu, murah aja, tiga ratus. Tiga ratus. Tiga ratus. Okay, so 300,000. Tiga ratus saja. Okay, so I think they kind of closed up. No, thank you, no, thank you. Ah, thank you. Yeah, I don't know what I do with it. Just carry a fish around. <laughs> Cheers, guys, thank you. <laughs> it's good, man. I love it. <laughs> ah, thank you. You're welcome. You're welcome. <laughs> Let's continue on. Let's continue on. You have the potatoes from the dust. All right, so it's kind of opening up over here. You can see the ocean pretty clearly. Look at all them bananas. Hello. Hello, Mister. Yeah, I want to try one. 
Mister. Bisa masuk? Masuk, masuk, masuk. Boleh, boleh. Beli pisang ambon. Boleh, boleh, boleh. Banana ambon. Banana ambon. Ya. Mau satu saja. Saya mau makan. Satu saja mau makan. Satu saja bisa makan. Rasa. Rasa. Ini. Coba dibuka. Let me try. Pertama. 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 Banana ambon. Banana ambon. Mister. Enak, enak. Enak sekali. Kalau makan ini. Hmm. <laughs> ini ada enak. Banana ambon. Beri ke banana. Banana. Hmm. Manis. I mean, there's all different kinds of bananas too. Like big bananas, small bananas, medium-sized bananas. I got banana on the lens. My, my name is Nick. My name is Mariam. Mariam? A turkey. <laughs> she just handed me a small one. Okay. This banana. Mm. And a pizza. And not, this one's good too. A little bit different taste. Like tangy almost. Mr. Pumidan Samarin. What? <laughs> Manis. These are delicious. Uh huh. Hmm. I've never seen so many bananas in my life. Banyak. Semua, semua dari Ambo. So basically, it just kind of wraps around the airport over there. And it was, we drove all the way over there and then loops around. Yeah. Woo. Okay, so from here, I didn't realize it was that far. Uh, I'm trying to go to the Ambon City Center and it's 11 kilometers away. I don't think I'm walking there. <laughs> so I'm gonna see if I can figure out how to get a taxi or see if somebody, if I can pay somebody to to drive me that way. See? Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Three bananas. Got some energy in me. Let's keep walking. So, like I said, I'm not gonna try to walk the entire way. Hopefully, I can find a way to get there. That's not a scooter or an Ancon or something. Hello. Huh? 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 How are you? I'm good, how are you? Ooh, look at all them chilies. Any padas? Yes. Padas, yeah. No thank you, no thank you. Light my ass on fire. I mean, it just never ends. From the beginning of that terminal area, all the way down here, there's nothing but people outside selling stuff. That lady was mean mugging me. Hello. Hello. That lady tried smiling at her. Didn't work. Did not work. How are you? Hello. Good. I gotta remember, when you're saying letters in Indonesia, even if they're English letters like the alphabet, you have to pronounce them in their soft form. A becomes A, B becomes B, C becomes Ch. And so when I told him I want to go to ACC, 
I should have said I want to go to Acha Cha. <laughs> and so that can get confusing when you're trying to tell people how to spell your name or how you, you know, you know how to write anything. You know, like my name would be Nick Nick K, not Nick K. Anyways, just hanging in, hanging out in the wagon. Nice. Woo. I should have worn a hat. Hello. <laughs> Tell you what though. It's uh looks pretty tough down here. Some tough living for some people. Yes. Nasi Padang? Dimana? Itu? Since I'm by the ocean, you think I'd uh, eat some, some good seafood or something. Some, some seafood, some ika ada. Ika. Anak, anak ika. Anak banget. Dimana? Disana. Disana. Well, I don't know. Okay. Yes. You too? Hi, hi. Okay. Please subscribe. Okay. 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 This way? Yeah. Okay, so they uh, I think they told me a good place to go eat. And uh, this is the uh, mechanics row right here. I'm good, how are you? My name's Benef. Nick. My name is Nick. Aldi. Aldi, nice to meet you, Aldi. Aldi, you working hard? Uh, I'm from. Yeah. I'm from. Uh, <laughs> I, I'm from America. Oh, I'm, uh, I'm from Indonesia. <laughs> Indonesia. Indonesia. <laughs> okay, cheers, man. Uh, cheers, Aldi. They're trying. They're trying. <laughs> Alrighty. We've gotten away from the market, that's for sure. It's a lot less hectic around here. But I think next... Uh, next order of business is I need to get an anka or a, a scooter. Somebody needs to pick me up because I think it's still a long ways away. Man. Some of these houses right on the coast right here are in pretty rough shape. You can tell they have a pretty nice view. Just looking out over the bay right here. All right, they wave down an anchor for me. Hello, Acheche? 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 Yeah. Okay. Can I come in here? Hey. Oh, oh, oh. All right. Let's go. Thank you. Thank you for stopping. Bertami? Bertama? Bertama. Thank you. Panas. Subscribe, yeah. Make sure I have everything, phone, uh, bag, everything. Okay. Okay. So this is where I'm meeting my friends from Jakarta, and there she is, right there. You made it. Huh? A jam lima, yeah? I know, I'm early, but... Huh? I'll go inside, okay? Alright. So, I'm... I'm wanting to meet her at 5 o'clock, and I'm a little early. It's 3.42. It's really... 
really a strange coincidence that I saw her heading out. And so I'm going to go in here and just hang out for a little bit. And then I think she's going to come back. So I want to go chill in the AC, get out of the sun because I am getting sunburned. Ooh. Hello. Hello. Uh, I'm just, I'm, I'm following you, but I you know, want to fall back me, right? This is the... Uh, I want to follow me. I know, I, I know. Follow, follow right I feel bad because I don't follow anybody on this account. I want, I, I follow, follow. I know, I know. You don't have to, though. You don't have to. You don't have to. I, I, you got a I, cute I son, though. Hello. You got a cute, yeah, you. <laughs> You're a cute. Bye. Yeah. Okay. Change of plans. I wasn't here long, just long enough to connect to some Wi-Fi. Uh, my friend, she wants to meet at Ambon Plaza now. And so I'm going to try to catch an Ancot. And we're heading back to where we just came from. Which that's fine. I got to come here and see what a mall looks like here in Ambon. Kind of reminds me of the malls back home in Lubbock, Texas. Pretty dead. Okay, I'm on Plaza. I'm on Plaza. Disana? Disana, yeah. Disana, yeah. Okay, I'm on Plaza. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, Plaza. Yeah. Yes. Okay, Plaza. Okay. All right. Hello. Hello. You gotta watch your head coming in here. And it looks like I'm right back where I started today. After that walk from, uh, don't get hit, through the market, took the hand caught all the way to that mall. I met my friend and she was like, oh, just meet me at a different place. She had to go back to the office apparently. But we're right back here. To be honest, I'm kind of getting tired of filming today, so I want to go ahead and do the outro. Uh, thank you for joining me on this adventure through Ambon. We're gonna try to venture out and go see more things later on. You know, maybe go to some beaches and go to some uh, other attractions throughout the islands. Maybe get out of this busy city center. And so, anyways, thank you for joining me, and I'll see you in the next video here from Ambon. Oh, sorry. Get out of their way. Okay. Hello. Hello. Any Ambon Plaza? Ah, Plaza. Ambon Plaza, okay. Hello. Uh, toilet, Tada. Toilet. 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 All the way in the back. Hello, Kana. Hello, Kana. Okay, thank you.